Calathea Aluia, Wikipedia article audio. Calathea Aluia, known as Lirin or Lirin in Spanish, and also known in English as Guinea arrowroot, and sweet corn root, is a plant in the arrowroot family, native to northern South America and the Caribbean. The name Aluia is derived from the Carib name for the plant. Lirin is a minor food crop in the American tropics but was one of the earliest plants domesticated by prehistoric Indians in South America. Lirin is considered native to Cuba, Hispaniola, Puerto Rico, the Lesser Antilles, Trinidad and Tobago, Venezuela, Colombia, Ecuador, Peru, and Brazil. It is reportedly naturalized in Jamaica. Distribution Description Lirin has been introduced as a minor root crop in tropical regions around the world. Lirin is a perennial plant, approximately 1 meter in height. It produces egg-shaped tuberous roots 2 cm to 8 cm long at the end of fibrous roots. The leaves are large, up to 60 cm long and 20 cm wide. Indigenous people of the Americas have used the durable leaves to make traditional medicines and as baby clothing. Lirin usually reproduces itself through rhizomes which produce shoots and new plants. Lirin is adapted to a tropical climate with alternating rainy and dry seasons. It sprouts with the first rains and grows rapidly forming tubers which are harvested as the foliage begins to die back eight or nine months after the initial sprouting. The rhizomes, harvested at the same time, are tolerant of both drying and flooding, and divided and replanted again at the onset of the rainy season. Frequent irrigation is necessary during dry periods. Lirin is often planted in shade or partial shade but can grow in full sun with adequate moisture and nutrients. Lirin is traditionally cultivated on a small scale. Its cultivation is declining as it has been replaced by other crops. Lirin is usually cooked by boiling the tubers for 15 to 60 minutes, as food, lirin is often compared to water chestnut because lirin like the water chestnut, retains its crispness despite being cooked. Boiled lirin has a taste similar to sweet corn, hence one of its common English names. The cooked tuber is covered with a thin, inedible skin which is most easily peeled after cooking. Lirin is mostly eaten as an hors d'oeuvre or appetizer. Lirin tubers can be stored at room temperatures for up to three months but do not tolerate refrigeration well. Cultivation The nutritional value of lirin has not been thoroughly studied, but the tubers have a starch content of 13 to 15 percent and a protein content of 6.6 percent. Archaeologists have discovered that lirin was one of the first plants domesticated in prehistoric South America. Lirin along with arrowroot, squash, and bottle gourd were being cultivated in northern South American and Panama between 8200 BCE and 5600 BCE. It appears that the cultivation of lirin spread to places where it was not likely native. For example, the people of the Las Vegas culture on the arid and semi-arid Santa Elena Peninsula of Ecuador grew lirin by about 7000 BCE. Lirin was being grown there to be eaten raw, dried, or ground into flour. Food Prehistoric Domestication <laughs>